Hi, let me tell you our story about the Gen Amplify Coronavirus 19 RT-PCR detection technology. It all started about a year ago, December, when the world was rocked by the appearance of a novel coronavirus in the province of Wuhan City in China. And after that virus gained entry into the global community, it completely changed the way we look at ourselves, our lives, our economy, and our health sector. The problem here in the Philippines at that time was the access to technology that would allow early diagnosis of the disease here in the Philippines. As a response to this need, a team of Filipino scientists with the support of the Department of Science and Technology developed the diagnostic technology PCR tests COVID-19. It went through a lot of challenges along the way, and such challenges allowed us to grow further and scale up our technology. The Gen Amplify COVID-19 test targets three genes, uh, which are your E gene, your RDRP gene, which are both for the for detection of the coronavirus, and the human endogenous control, which is the RNA gene. So it's a one-step RT-PCR technology that simultaneously amplifies all of these three targets. Based on studies, the diagnostic kit can detect as low as 0 0.05 copies per ml, 100% of the time, for both the targets, and about 100% specificity for both in silico and for test panels of the respiratory origin. It has a 91 to 95% concordance based on our field implementation studies, looking at the technology in comparison with the foreign technologies here in the country. The process of developing a PCR technology for clinical use is very labor intensive and arduous. It comes with doing performance laboratory standards. On top of that, you have to do the clinical diagnostic standards followed by field implementation of studies and a post-marketing surveillance report. All of these things are being done to ensure the safety of our public and the safety of the patients who will be undergoing the same test. So the field implementation study was made possible with the strong support of the Department of Science and Technology and the Philippine Council for Health Research and Development. We're currently completing our most marketing surveillance to allow us to monitor the behavior of the technology as a product. But beyond the COVID-19 testing, there is more impact in the scientific community of what actually meant. This support from the largest research funding organization in the country, the DOST, has created a lot of learnings from us technology developers. So we won't be able to learn all of these things to be able to come up with the product of such standard without this particular support. It also creates a lot of implications for health technology growth here in the country. One, it actually promotes and accelerates the growth of the health biotechnology ecosystem in the Philippines. Second, it creates opportunities for small researchers to start thinking of how it can actually be spin off into biotech companies later that can actually support and help the growth, the macroeconomic growth of the country. Third, it will provide opportunities for our young scientists to stay in the country, to work here because there are more job opportunities if we keep the biotechnology landscape growing. And fourth, it will increase the country's competitiveness in the biotechnology race, in the field of infectious disease diagnostics, or even in non-communicable diseases. So this entire platform is looking for Filipino adapters coming from Filipino developers. Our biotechnology is still very small, but are very much willing to learn. So in behalf of the entire research team, Gen Amplify Coronavirus RT-PCR Detection Kit, we would like to express our heartfelt thanks to the Department of Science and Technology and the Department of Health for the support in bringing this technology to the public and to our country. Thank you.